What's up girly? Welcome back to my channel. I have a lot to explain about why I didn't post last week even though I did record for the whole, for a few days. I was going to say the whole weekend but it went on for a few more days and I didn't get to post it. So I already got to explain it a little bit on TikTok but now I need to explain this to YouTube. But I could not wait to tell you everything that happened. So I'm just going to start from the very beginning. I recorded a vlog last weekend and it went on till like Monday or Tuesday. And on Wednesday or Thursday, I was going to go edit it. So I took my laptop to work on on Thursday. I took my laptop to work on Thursday. Pretty much early in the morning before any kids came, I opened up my laptop and I put my memory card in it. So at first, everything was going smoothly. I just had my videos imported. And so I went ahead and took out the little memory card. And it looked just fine. And then I was working on it for about a couple more minutes. And then suddenly, half my video said missing file. Just like out of nowhere. It was really random. And so I was like, okay, maybe they weren't done importing. And when I put the flash drive back into the laptop, it was saying like, files could not be found like disk cannot be read that's what I was saying disk cannot be read and so I was like that's weird so I put the memory card back into my camera and it said memory card error and so at this point I was pretty freaked out so straight after work I went to Best Buy and I went to their geek squad area and I had them take my card and they ran like a recovery like data recovery to try to recover it they called me later that night and as soon as I saw that they called me I like started getting my shoes on I was about to go get my car tonight and start editing that video but then they left me a voicemail and they told me it was corrupt and they said that they couldn't recover any of the data on it so the videos were just lost and I could come pick up my card and I was like okay so whenever I got there I was just asked asking them like how did it corrupt and they just said it could have been literally anything they said it could have been anything so I was like I still have no clue how it corrupts so I bought a new flash drive and I bought a new memory card and then I went home and so I was just thinking like maybe my laptop was the problem because he said something like oh it could have been like your laptop short circuited it like it could have been anything I was like so I reset my laptop and when I reset my laptop I was trying to like reinstall Mac OS and it would not let me reinstall Mac OS. It, I just kept running into so many errors every time like every different way that I tried to do it. So at this point I was really freaked out because I have plans today. I'm going to the Pumpkin Spectacular and I want to get um, a jack-o'-lantern this weekend. Well I get a pumpkin and turn it into a jack-o'-lantern this weekend. And I wanted to do it all for YouTube and I wanted to spend the next couple days editing it so I could put it out like right at Halloween time. I had just about enough to get me a new laptop and so on Friday, that was yesterday, after work I went back to the Best Buy and I try to exchange my old laptop for a new one even though it was reset and it didn't have mac os i was like they'll probably still take it i even googled it and it said it would still take it and so whenever i went the girl who helped me she was pretty nice although i'm not going into that right now but it, it was a little bit shady i'll mention to you in a minute but um sh she was really nice and she took my laptop over there to the geek squad area because it didn't have mac os and they were going to try to like get it real quick or something and she brought it back to me and she told me that my entire laptop was corrupt she said that the hard drive was corrupt something like that and so i don't know what to do at this point like i guess you could send it away to apple or somewhere and they could like try to fix it or do something but at this point it's not even worth it because the laptop I have is really old. Well, it's not really old. It's only 2015, but it's old enough that you can't use certain apps or like all the latest updates and stuff. So getting a new laptop really helped me to like use CapCut and like the newest version of iMovie so that I can post videos on YouTube. So then they said that they couldn't took it. They couldn't take it. I can't even talk. <laughs> so then they said that they couldn't take my laptop. But at this point, I still needed a laptop. So I was just going to use, like, pretty much most of the money I had and buy me one. Here's where it gets a little bit sneaky. So I knew exactly which laptop I wanted. So I went and she checked and she said that there was none in the... None at all. I was about to say none in the silver color. But no, she said there was none at all. And so I was like, can you check the other Best Buy? Like, the other one in town? And she was like, yeah, and she was looking on her phone. She said that they had one of the space gray ones. And so I was like, well, I better go get it. Even though I really wanted the silver one, I was like, I better just go get that space gray one before someone else does because I really need a laptop like this weekend. Then she was like, oh, do you want to pay for it here and like go get it over there? And I was like, no, I'll just go over there and I'll look and 
she was just like, oh, I'm so sorry, we couldn't do anything for you, and I was like, it's okay. So then I drove to the other Best Buy, which was about 22 minutes away, like, I left that one, I drove straight there, I had to pee so bad, but I just, like, ignored that, because I was so excited to get a laptop, and whenever I got there, I walked in, told them I was wanting to buy a MacBook, and I knew exactly which one I wanted, so I went over to them, and I was just, like, waiting by the MacBooks for a while, and the guy came over to me, and I told him which one I wanted, and I was like, you don't have the silver, do you? And he was like, yeah, we got the silver, and I was like, Okay, so he comes back after a minute holding the laptop and he was like, you ready to check out? And I was like, is that this one right here? Just like making sure, is, is that this one? And he was like, yup. And I was like, is it silver? And he was like, yup. And I was like, oh, it's so weird because the other store said you guys had none in stock. And um, he was like, oh, we got like tons of silver back there. <laughs> and I was like, oh, she said you just had one. Space gray one, but... Maybe their systems are inaccurate, so that's what I'm going to go with. But it gets shadier with this guy. So, like, I liked her. And she actually told me she watches me on TikTok, and we took a picture. So, I like her. I'm not going to blame her for that. But he got a little bit of an attitude. Not an attitude, but he was so unenthusiastic about this whole transaction. It was a little bit weird. So, we go over to checkout to buy my laptop. And as soon as we get over there, he's trying to sign me up for the credit card. He's like, it's $200 free money, like you're basically stupid if you don't sign up for this like that's how he made me feel and so I was just like no like I don't know anything about credit cards I'm okay like it took a lot in me there's like a hair flying around it took a lot in me to get the cash to come here and decide I'm gonna spend the cash on this like I'm not signing up for your credit card I don't have any credit cards that's something that people say on TikTok they're like oh he's probably in debt no everything is cash but um he tried really hard to sign me up for it and then he was just like okay 2150 like that's how much it was and so I scanned my phone and it approved for 2000 and he was like all right it approved for 2000 you still owe 150 and then he instantly was like oh but this credit card you'd get the 200 it's free money like you might as well take it like you're you're so fucking stupid enough to take it like excuse me but that's how it made me feel I was just like no thank you let me call my bank or no I, I didn't know what to do I didn't say let me call my bank I was asking him I was like what does that mean like is it because I've never spent that much money before and so he was like yeah you just got to call your bank and they'll tell you what to do and so I called the bank I talked to the lady on the phone and she told me to just hit the x on the pin instead of like running it as debit and it would approve and so as soon as she said that and like I was on speaker with him he was just like yeah you just hit the x and like it was like he acted like he already knew that like he wanted me to sign up for the credit card so bad that he had me call the bank instead of just like telling me I could do that like he definitely knew that I could just hit the x and it would go through and as soon as it went through he was just like grab the receipt put the stuff in the bag handed it to me and he was like have a good day he was so upset but i was so happy i had a laptop i like called my mom i told her that whole story and she was just like yeah he probably gets commission from it i was like oh for sure but his just attitude wasn't it and the people at the first best buy they were so nice and like half of them knew me from tiktok that's not like the only reason they were nice they were just super nice in general and whenever i walked into the second best buy they were like what you here for <laughs> i was like to buy a laptop it's really nice this is 2022 actually debatable I told them, and I thought it said 2022 on the thing, but when you look at the About This Mac, am I really low? When you look at the About This Mac on the laptop, it says 2023. And so I was like, wait, is it 2023? I don't know. Maybe someone can help me out with that. I don't know how long this story time has already gotten, but I need to get into it. I need to go get a pumpkin from Walmart. And I need to get some pumpkin carving stuff because we're going to be carving a pumpkin probably not tonight, tomorrow night. So that way we can have it set out for Halloween. I carved a pumpkin. There's a plane. So rude. I don't even know if you can hear it. Hopefully like not. I carved a pumpkin at my job with the kids and tell me why it like rotted after two or three days. So I think maybe I just didn't scoop out enough of the guts. Maybe that was it. So we're going to do a really good job on our pumpkin. And we're going to the Jack-O-Lantern Spectacular tonight, and that's going to be really fun. My hairdresser, the girl who cuts my hair, she told me she was going at the same time. So we might see her, hang out with her for a little bit. I'm really happy to be back in business with YouTube. Oh my gosh, I just hit 10,000 subscribers. That was insane. I so badly wanted to record that reaction. Like, I was watching it get close, and I was like, don't do it yet. Don't do it until I have a memory card. <laughs> But it did it, and I'm still so happy anyways. Like, that's insane for someone who's only posted two videos. And 
I'm so sad I didn't get to post the vlog from last weekend because so much good stuff happened in that vlog. It was like, I didn't even go out and do much, but I did so much at the house. Like, we had a movie night together. We were feeding the animals. It was so intimate, but we'll do all that stuff again. That's nothing we can't do again. I'm gonna go get ready. I'm wearing this jacket and this just tank top and these jeans, so it's pretty cute, just basic fit. I got a bunch of clothes from Timu today. Um, I got like a little deal going on with Timu. I'll just let you guys know about that, but... Um, I ordered actually so much cute stuff. Like, I'm really impressed with everything that, that I got. I was like, wow, I selected some great things. And they're actually in the dryer right now. So I'm going to be able to wear something to the Jack-O-Lantern Spectacular tonight. So this is just for now. I'm just going to go to Walmart, go get a pumpkin, and get into it. Let's get into it. I just left Walmart pumpkin secured. I didn't vlog in there, but I did vlog for TikTok. That bag is just a Goodwill bag that's been in here for like a month now. I need to take that to Goodwill, but... We're gonna go home, it's 3.35, and that pumpkin event is at, oh my gosh, I don't wanna put random people in my video. I, I feel bad recording random people. My pumpkin video, oh, I can't even think now. The pumpkin, the pumpkin Spectacular starts at 6.30, so I need to get home, I wanna post that TikTok, and then I need to get started on another TikTok, and we're just gonna see how it all goes. I'm about to order some food real quick in my steak and shake, because I haven't ate much at all today. They have a pumpkin spice Oreo milkshake that sounds so good but that would probably make my stomach hurt oh my gosh they got chicken fingers again they didn't have chicken fingers for a while i was going to get a cheeseburger but maybe i should get chicken fingers uh -oh. can i get the three-piece chicken tender combo with buff i mean barbecue sauce and what's a drink uh a sweet tea anything else no that's it 8.47. Thank you. Why do I sound so stupid? <laughs> Usually I get buffalo, but I just want barbecue tonight because, you know, I got a lot of plans later. Don't need the extra toots. Who does? Hello. I follow you on TikTok. <laughs> really? Yes, I do. Oh That's crazy. <laughs> oh my God, you're following me on TikTok. <laughs> it's okay. The way your house is I love the peak. Your house is beautiful. Thank you. 847. Here, can I do Apple Pay? Yeah. Okay. So pretty. I love your lashes, your tattoos, everything. Oh my god, can I take a photo with you real quick? Yeah. If you post it on Instagram or something, tag me so I can see it. Alright. Here's your sweet tea. Thank you. Thank you so much, you too. That was so funny. She was so cute. Oh my gosh. Look at the cat on the roof in the trailer park. <laughs> the cats around here kill me. So freaking cute. Oh my gosh. I just wanted to try out the zoom. He's so cute. That's my neighbor's trailer. What's up, girlie? I'm back home. I pretty much ate all my food in the car. Oh my gosh, there's a hair in my lens. That's like just life with cats, okay? But I ate like all my food in the car. The traffic was pretty bad. And now it's time to get ready for the Jack-O-Lantern Festival. I'm so excited. I just want to show you some of the new clothes that I got from Timu because I'm definitely going to wear something that I got. So like this ain't sponsored. Like what you see on TikTok will be, but this ain't. So I got these sweatpants. They're so cute the way they crisscross over in the front. And so I was thinking of wearing those, but they're a little bit short for me. I wish they were just a little bit longer so if not if I'm not comfortable in those then I'm gonna I got some jeans in the dryer right now but they're still drying I just got all this out from the dryer I wanted to clean it but look how freaking cute this varsity jacket is it looks almost exactly like the one that I've had for the longest so it's honestly just really old looking it's a little bit thinner so it's not gonna keep you as warm but I mean it's really cute to be honest, I don't remember the prices of all these. Like, whenever I pick stuff out, they send me a special link. So I don't really see the prices. But this is really cute, and this could be really cute, like, underneath one of these jackets. But I really wanted a jacket like this from H&M the other day. And I'm so happy that I got this one from Timu. It's so cute. Now, when I ordered this, I could have swore I got a pink one. But maybe that was something else. So I did three orders, and this is just one of them. I also got these super cute socks, so I'm definitely going to be wearing some of these socks. It's just really giving, like, fall. I think that the theme for this video was winter clothes, and then I have two other videos that I'm going to do. Hi, Tamari. Hi, kitty kitty. So I've got to figure out what I'm going to wear now. I'll show you what those sweatpants look like on me, and let's try on something. So far, I really like this top. It's a little bit see-through. 
like in dark lighting it's not bad and i'll probably have a jacket on anyways oh from like this lighting back here i feel like you can see it see through real bad oh my gosh maybe it is really see-through but it's still a really cute piece I really was thinking about wearing this jacket, but this jacket's a little bit tight. I think I need not like a sweater with it. Hey, this is pretty cute. I look really cozy. Oh my gosh, this is cute. I kind of like this. I'm not gonna lie. It's really warm. Even with a sweater, it's giving cute. Let's put on the sweatpants. Sweatpants are pretty cute. Hang on, I'm gonna put on socks and then show you the whole fit. Now here's the whole fit, although I'm not sure I'm actually gonna wear these sweatpants. They are kind of a sleigh. Like I really like this part right here. I kind of, I hate when they're like tight at the bottom like that. Maybe some people don't mind it, but I think these are actually pretty cute. Oh, and they got pockets. That's nice. Although I'll probably try the jeans on and see what those are like, but this is actually like a really good backup. I feel like I would need the right shoes with these. I don't have any like fall like shoes. Let's try on this gray puffer coat jacket real quick. See, this is really cute, although I don't think it really matches the top at all. Kind of matches the sweatpants, but really doesn't go well with this top compared to that other one. I also forgot I got this like sleeveless black turtleneck. It's pretty cute. I don't think I'm going to wear that tonight though. And then I had gotten this high neck bodysuit and it's black and it's so cute. And this is honestly a really good backup if I'm not feeling the top I'm wearing right now. But I'm going to try these jeans on with the top. Let's see what that looks like. I don't really want my belly hanging out tonight and these pants just aren't high enough to not have that happen. So I think I'm going to try on the bodysuit. I know I wear stuff like this all the time, but it's just like really comfortable for me. And this one from Timu especially is like really thin and comfortable. And I was so tempted to just wear that, but I'm going to wear this because I feel like it's giving more fall and I want to wear something different, you know? I just wanted to touch up my makeup real quick. This light is so bright. I just take what's left of my little foundation brush and just kind of freshen up everywhere that needs to it actually doesn't look too bad right now and i'm gonna take i grabbed the wrong brush you're sitting on top of my brushes right now because i was being so lazy would y'all kill me if i said i changed my entire outfit i just wanted to be comfortable and it's a little bit warm out so why not wear shorts for the one last time i gotta get some gas real quick the apple card reader don't work Let that shit fill up. You guys, I don't know if I can do this. There is a huge, huge, huge line of people. And there is like so many cars trying to park that it's so backed up. And it's also raining. Oh my gosh. Why is it so so busy like what is is that you have to stand in that huge line to get to it you can't really see it from here you can see a little bit right there that's the line and it goes all the way down to there and it's raining i don't have a hood i don't have an umbrella those people got umbrellas and they're like directing people <laughs> there's the line there's more of it <gasps> i'm just gonna show you there's like more of the line all the way over here. And this is about, this is where everyone's entering. It goes all the way down there too. Like it's still going. I can't, I can't sit in that line. I did not know it was going to be like this. <laughs> I would truly rather go shopping or something. This, I started a TikTok doing this. And I started taking pictures and uh, I already started planning the post. Maybe I should just carve my pumpkin tonight. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just can't do this alone. Not without an umbrella. Not even a freaking hood. It said it wasn't going to start raining until like 8 or 9. You can't trust Apple Maps. I mean, Apple weather. You just can't. Or the maps. I mean, damn. I actually drove to the wrong place at first. But it was right down the street. And then I was like, I hope this ain't it. And this is it. I'm going forward. I can't. It's so long. I want to keep going forward and see how much longer it gets, too. Okay. <laughs> Sorry I hyped up nothing. We're still going to do a lot. Look. Big ass line. I mean, they are moving. Is that the entrance? I think that's finally. Oh, you enter the theater. Is it inside? I thought it was outside. I really don't know what the f I bought tickets for. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's more people directing over here. 
There's lots more parking over here, but then you still have to go get in that line and it's raining. I'm so sorry, I hyped it up for nothing. I'm a little bit disappointed. I've never had anything that I planned like that go so sideways or just not really be what I expected it to be. I really didn't know much about the event. I thought it was actually outside, but it looks like it was inside, so I really don't have any clue what it was supposed to look like but i'm going to go inside and chill for a little bit if you know what i mean and then i'm going to decide if i want to carve my pumpkin tonight or paint one of my pumpkins tonight maybe i should just paint the one tonight because i didn't want to carve it too early because the one that i carved in my classroom i carved it on like a friday and then by monday morning it smelled like rotten on the inside but i think i said earlier that I don't think I got all the guts out and stuff, so I'm definitely going to do better this time. But I don't want to carve it till at least tomorrow, so it doesn't look rotten or nothing at all until Halloween. And you know, I might have it out a couple days extra because I put a lot of love into carving it. Haven't done it yet, but I love carving pumpkins. I think it's just really fun and creative. What's up girlies? It's a little bit later. I decided to paint the pumpkin tonight and I did something a little bit special and I went live on TikTok for the first time ever. You guys can say hi girlies if you want to say hi to the YouTube. But this is the pumpkin that we have. I'm gonna give them a second to start saying hi. Ugh, pick up the pumpkin. We're painting a pink pumpkin with a ghost on it and they said I should put a Hello Kitty bow on the ghost and then we're gonna write like a what's up girly on the back or something fun like that. But everyone wanted to say, hey girly, they were like, I better be in the YouTube video. If you're saying hi in the chat, you gotta go watch the YouTube video too. <laughs> this is my first time going live on TikTok and it's honestly really fun. There's like no cuts, so we're just being really raw right now. And that's kind of what I like to do on YouTube too. It's time for a little update on my pumpkin. It came out so freaking cute. Look at the Hello Kitty bow I did. I know she's a little bit wonky and someone on TikTok live told me that her eye looks like a heart. And now I can't unsee it. But I wrote What's Up Girlies on the back. And I'm just so proud of it. Even though it's not perfect. I think I think it's so cute. I can't wait to take pictures of it. I've been on TikTok live for over two hours. I think that's literally insane. This is my first live ever. And I think we really... We went big with it. I have over 600,000 likes. What does that mean? There's only 700 people in the chat now. There was over 1,000 at one point. Still, 700 is freaking insane. The chat's still going crazy. Everyone's saying, hey, girlies. You're going to see all your comments on YouTube. And <laughs> you better be watching the YouTube video. That's all I got to say. What's up, girlie? That was crazy. I just got off. I was on live for almost three hours. That was my first time ever going live. It was low-key really fun, and it made the time go by really fast. And I painted my pumpkin, which you saw. She's so freaking cute. I feel like before, when I was trying to record and I was on live, I felt very nervous with everyone watching me record. My hair looks kind of messy right now. And now that I'm off live, I feel much more chill again. Um, so, I'm just going to chill for the rest of the night. I need to eat something. And tomorrow we'll carve our pumpkin. And we'll go grocery shopping. And we'll do all that fun stuff. And hopefully I can post this YouTube video by about Halloween day. Good morning, really. It's the next day. It's really not morning. It's 3.25 p.m. I was up till like 2 a.m. because I talked to some of my online friends after I got off of the live last night. And then I really just slept in because when you work full time, you sleep in anytime you get to. But um, I just want to show you the outfit today because it's kind of eaten. Oh my gosh, you can see me in the background. But um, it's all from Timu. This obviously ain't sponsored, but we've already talked about that. This shirt, I got this jacket, and then the sweatpants like are really eaten. At first I was like, I could probably find some better pants, but... No, the sweatpants are the only ones that are eaten. Although, <laughs> I'm saying that way too much. I just, I think this outfit's pretty cute. And it's like totally something different from what I would normally wear. But anyways, I'm about to go to Meijer. And I'm going to do my little shop with me. Grocery shopping TikTok. And then whenever I come back, we'll carve the pumpkin. Just me and you. I might do a couple little ticks for, uh, clips for TikTok. But it's mostly just going to be us. I was wondering if I should end the vlog tonight or if I should do one more day and take my camera to work tomorrow and kind of show you what it looks like whenever I set up for the Halloween party because we're having a Halloween party at my job tomorrow and that might be fun to add to the video because I've only done two days of recording so it might not be very long. So hopefully 
carving the pumpkin tonight. Maybe I could do that tomorrow. I wish I could ask you. You're just gonna have to wait and find out. I almost totally forgot. I got this iced coffee from McDonald's, but look at how sus it looks. See how dark it is? I know this ain't the best lighting. Hang on. This definitely ain't. I rewatched my last clip just because I was curious what it looked like, and I definitely need to shave my face today and like do an upwards angle. I was showing so much double chin, but that's okay. It's just bodies. I shave my face like every three days. I just don't want to overshave it because I don't want to like ruin my skin. So I don't mind having a little bit of facial hair, but I definitely don't like having it. This is pretty good. I'm just going to avoid the bottom because it looks really shady. I should have just started the video from here. This is such good lighting. But we're going to go ahead and head to Myers, and I'm going to do a little grocery shopping TikTok and then we'll come back carve the pumpkin. Maybe I can actually find a pumpkin carving kit because yesterday I just found a freaking scooper and a knife set from Walmart. So maybe I can find a proper kit at Meyer. I just need to apply some. I want to use this. I've been using this so much lately and I actually feel like it's so good for your lips, like hydrating. What's up, girly? It's grocery shopping day. We got to run because it's raining. I didn't even bring an umbrella. Muscle Grilly is grocery shopping day. We gotta run because it's raining. I didn't even bring an umbrella. Muscle Grilly is. Do you think that's good? I was just trying to do something quick and fast. You know I'm bad at intros. This drink, you just gotta keep the straw away from that thick syrup. I don't know what that is. Is it like a pumpkin spice syrup? Because this is the pumpkin spice latte at McDonald's. It's my first time having it. it. Tastes pretty good, but then you get that thick syrup at the bottom. It's almost like they just put caramel or something. I was hoping the rain would calm down. It literally sounds like it's getting heavier. So I guess I'm just gonna actually run for it. Damn it, why didn't I bring the umbrella? I keep forgetting it. It's in my work purse, but it's also broken, so maybe I'll buy a new umbrella. I don't know. I'm just talking. Let's go shopping. What's up, girlies? I'm ready to start carving my pumpkin, but we need to go pick out a movie. I want to watch a movie while I do it. Here's my little setup I got so far. I just put the pumpkin on a little pink trash bag, and I'm gonna get another bag for the guts. I could not find a pumpkin carving kit at Walmart or at Meyer, so I just got these. I saw some people on my TikTok, I posted a TikTok of the part, the pumpkin I carved at work, and some people were concerned, because I used a knife, but my boss gave me that knife to use. It wasn't just my choice. I'm trying to flip up my thing. There we go. Maybe they couldn't find a pumpkin carving set either, but as you can see, clearly seeing the video we were safe with it but I just set the vibe I got like some candles going and we're gonna go in the toy room and pick out a movie for us to watch while we do this oh my gosh I didn't realize that there was stuff knocked over in here it looks like my cats probably did that I'm not even gonna worry about it right now but this is the toy room I got like some really cute stuff right there and then let me shut this door just so that you don't really peep the litter box because that's where the litter box goes. Here's my outfit for the little fun night we're about to have. In the last vlog, we had watched Tana Montana the movie, which I haven't even put back yet. But I was deciding between that or Sharpay's Fabulous Adventure. But I'm really feeling like a Barbie movie tonight. Okay, maybe I should pick out one of these movies. Never seen 12 Dancing Princesses, so this is the one we're going to watch.
Check out my pumpkin. Oh my gosh, it's so freaking cute. I put a little tea light that I had in there. It's like a pink butterfly tea light. It's the only one I had. But I've never actually put a candle inside of a pumpkin before. I just went real basic. I have, it's 7.40 right now. I have work tomorrow, so. Honestly, I was hoping I had more time for this, but I didn't. I also was supposed to do two teeth and I accidentally cut one. So he's just got one tooth. Oh my gosh, look how pretty. You can see the tea light. Wow, this camera is nice. Ooh. Ah. Will this scare you away? <laughs> but um, I'm going to check out for the night, and then in the morning, we'll go to work. To, we'll go to work together. <laughs> I look so funny sitting like this. I just wanted to be by the pumpkin. We will go to work tomorrow in the morning together, and we will set up for the Halloween party. I'll let you get to see all that. Oh, I didn't even get to show you what I bought. So I bought some stuff. I bought this stuff right here for the party. Just so that my kids have like activities to do. So this is like pin the nose on the pumpkin. Upside down. So cute. And then I got them like Halloween slime, Halloween markers, Halloween stamps, Halloween notebooks, just stuff like that. So that it, that's stuff they can do while they're at school. Cause they're gonna get candy and like stuff to take home. But that's stuff that they can do with me. So, I'm laying on the floor awkward, girly, but my pumpkin's so cute. Maybe we should blow out the candle. Is it like burning it? I feel like I'm giving him a kiss. Thank you for the kiss, pumpkin. Anyways, I'll see you in the morning, girly. What's up, girly? I just got ready for work. I'm wearing pretty much the same exact outfit as yesterday, just like a different tank top, but... It's time for me to go now, and we're going to set up for the Halloween party today. I'll get to show you little clips of that, although I probably won't get to record much until, like, nap time. And there will be nap time music, so I might do a little music over part. I don't know, but either way, we're going to hang out just a little bit longer. I just got to work. There's no kids here yet, so don't worry. I'm probably not going to be doing most of my setting up until nap time when they're asleep because parents are bringing in lots of decorations today and lots of snacks, so it's going to be lots of cute stuff to set up. Sorry, I'm so out of breath. I literally like ran in here, <laughs> but um, I'm gonna be hanging stuff from the ceilings. I'm gonna be um, putting stuff on the tables. Here's a little tour of my classroom. What's up, girl? I hope this lighting isn't horrible. I'm on my 30 minute break and I just got some McDonald's. I need to crack open into the sweet tea right this second. We're having our Halloween party today. All my kids are dressed up. They're being a little bit crazy. Mm, this lighting is atrocious. I got a Happy Meal, so let's see what toy I got real quick. Oh, don't tell me it's something boring. What is this? Teen Titans Trivia. It's like a coloring sheet. I wanted an actual toy. Whatever, I'll probably actually give this to the kids at my job. Let them color on it. Not today. We're doing everything Halloween themed today. But look at this tiny little fries. Don't these used to be bigger? <laughs> it's okay. Uh, I really only wanted this for the apple slices and them pores didn't give me no apple slices and what am I gonna do I can't even shut it now hello can't shut it this is making me all the way frustrated <laughs> trying to close it next time you see me I'll be in the classroom it's gonna be nap time, so the music will be going, so I might just do a little voiceover or a little music over. We'll see how it looks. I do not like this lighting. It looked really good over here. This is, this is some good lighting.
What's up, girl? I just got home. That was so much fun. I literally love decorating for classroom parties. Like every kid's birthday, I always go go all out. I'm so excited to try out my new laptop with the editing. I'm gonna try like maybe some new stuff. And like always, I hope that you have already subscribed. I hope that you have already decided to like this video. And I hope that you've already left a comment that I can respond to. It's so fun responding to comments. And you guys give me all the motivation to keep posting. Thank you so much for hitting over 10,000 subscribers already. That is insane. I know I've already said that but it's insane. I love you all so much. Also ring the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my videos because you know it's so random right now but I'm trying to post at least once a week. That's my goal at the moment. Hopefully more in the future. I just have so much editing I need to go do now so until next time I'll see you later girly.